My name is Dr. Melissa McKee and today I'm going to talk to you about IRAP. IRAP is a substance that is naturally produced by blood cells and it is a powerful anti-inflammatory molecule. It does this by binding onto receptor sites on the cells and blocking the attachment of other molecules that produce severe inflammation. We create IRAP by drawing the horse's blood into a specially prepared syringe that is filled with glass beads that stimulate the blood cells to produce a high concentration of the IRAP molecules. We incubate that syringe generally for 24 hours and then we spin off the blood and obtain just the serum that contains a high concentration of IRAP molecules in it. This we separate into separate syringes for individual joint injection purposes. This is an eight-year-old standard bred racehorse who is developing some lameness problems in the left front leg. Through various diagnostic techniques, we determined that he has some arthritic changes or degenerative joint disease in his left front fetlock. He did not respond very well to some of the other more traditional medications such as hyaluronic acid injections into the joint, so we decided to go ahead and process a blood sample to create IRAP um, and inject that to see if he responds to that therapy a little better. So here we have a joint that we've performed a sterile preparation and scrub on and I'm wearing sterile gloves. I've inserted the needle directly into the joint and now I am waiting to obtain some joint fluid. I do that because I want to see what color the fluid is and the consistency of it because it gives me an idea of how much inflammation is in the joint. Ideally joint fluid should be like clear corn syrup, nice and thick and very stringy. In this case, fortunately, it doesn't look too bad. So we draw off a little bit of joint fluid and then we inject a fairly large volume of the eye wrap. Usually in a fetlock joint we can get about 3 or 4 cc's in quite comfortably. So that was the routine procedure for injecting eye wrap into a horse's joint. While we usually get 5 to 7 injections out of one serum collection, we obviously don't need to use them all at once. The good news is we can freeze the leftover injections for future use. If a horse has a severe problem and is going to need some rest, our preference is to use one shot in the joint per week for four weeks, and then we bank the remainder for future use. So thank you for watching this presentation. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact your veterinarian for more information about IRAP.